Agroca is the largest retail joint stock company in Croatia. Originally founded in 1976 as a company producing flowers and flower seedlings, it greatly expanded their operations in the following decades by acquiring a number of large companies in Croatia and Southeast Europe. The Agroca Group had an annual sales revenue of 4.6 billion European euros in 2010. This made Agroca the biggest company in Croatia in terms of sales revenue and placed it 18th in Deloitte's annual list of the 500 biggest Central European companies. History, founded as a private firm for the production of flowers and flower seedlings in 1976. By 1977, business was expanded by new programs, import and export of cereals, oil crops, fruit and vegetables begin to flourish with a significant increase in turnover and profits. In 1989 the joint stock company Agroca was registered. The Agroca Group was registered in 1977. In 2000, Agroca opened the largest distribution center in Croatia the region. Logistics and distribution center in Dugopolje opened in 2010. The most modern winery in the region worth a 20 million was opened at Bolje in 2011. First Biogas facility was opened in grades in 2012. Acquisitions, Agroca's core businesses are the production and distribution of food and drinks and retail, and over the years the group acquired several large Croatian companies in those sectors, Jamnica, the largest water bottling company in Croatia, established in the 1830s and acquired by Agroca in 1992. Zvijezda, the largest cooking oil and margarine factory in the country established in 1916 by Samuel David Alexander and acquired in 1993. Konzum, the largest supermarket chain in the country which operates over 600 stores in Croatia, Bosnia and Herzegovina and Serbia. Originally founded as Unikonzum in 1957, the company was acquired by Agroca in 1994, Lido, the largest ice cream and frozen food manufacturer in Croatia, established in 1976 and acquired in 1994. P.I. Cave Bovec, the largest meat manufacturer in the country, acquired in 2005. Belge, the largest agricultural company in the country, acquired in 2005. Agrologina, winemaking, olive growing and cattle farming company acquired in 2005. Tysac the largest chain of newsstands in the country and the biggest retailer of newspapers and tobacco products. Agroca acquired a 54% majority stake in Tysac in 2007. In recent years, Agroca also acquired or founded a number of companies in the region, including the Serbian ice cream manufacturer Fricom, water bottling companies Sarajevski Kaseljak and Fonjodi and others. Several of Agroca's Croatian subsidiaries are listed on the Zagreb Stock Exchange and Lido is included in its official share index Crobex as of September 2010. For approaching international capital markets, Agroca had to receive a rating by a rating agency as this is a must to give potential investors a benchmark. Without the ratings of Standard & Poor's and Moody's, Agroca could not have issued two major bonds. In April 2012, Standard & Poor a Euro Unregistered Trademark S also revised the outlook on Agroca's a Euro bar Euro Unregistered Trademark rating to positive from stable. Agroca had to be considered by the Croatian market regulator Croatian Competition Agency for some of its acquisitions. The most recent example is a request for approval of acquisition of Mercator where Agroca will have to shut down some retail locations in Croatia. As of 2011, Agroca is planning to take over Mercator, which is the biggest retail chain not just in Slovenia, but also throughout the Balkans, with over a 2,000 stores. In June 2014, Agroca finalized the acquisition of a 80.75% stake in Mercator. On June 27, Agroca acquired the majority stake of Poslevni system Mercator and became its majority owner. The total value of the transaction amounts to 544 million European euros, out of which 324 million European euros are for the acquisition of 100% of shares, 200 million European euros will be used for deleveraging Mercator's financial position and 20 million European euros for working capital requirements of Mercator's operations. Controversies 
some of the broker's acquisitions of the state-owned companies were being investigated by Croatian authorities as illegal or inadequately transparent. Close to the late Croatian president Franjo Tuchman, Ivica Tudoria secured a number of exclusive to him privatization opportunities in return for kickbacks, common practice during Croatian privatization processes of the 1990s, also known as Croatian privatization controversy. See also, Croatian privatization controversy, Economy of Croatia, Franjo Timan. References External links, Agroka HR, official website.